I want to welcome you to this particular demonstration. This is the joint venture with the home seller. And we generally get these off of expired listings. This is where home sellers are trying to sell and there's a problem. Well, let's just paint a picture. We have a $100,000 house, ARV, okay? And it's free and clear and it needs 10,000 in work to be able to get to that 100,000 ARV. Well, what happens if you do the 70% of ARV minus cost of 10,000, you're going to offer them what? 60,000. Well, 60,000 for a 100,000 dollar house, they might take it. But then again, if we could do better than that, wouldn't that be a great deal for the seller? So this is called a joint venture with the seller. And the benefits are the seller is happy and the realtor, if the realtor has an expired listing, he can get his commission. It's good for minor rehabs. And I'm going to say that again. It's good for minor rehabs. How can you make 10000 Well, let's take a look. If we gave the seller 69000 but we bought it subject to, in a note, if there's existing financing or just a private first mortgage of 69000 and we tell them, Mr. Seller, we're going to pay you off in this note within four months. And there's going to be no payments on the note. And we will give you 69000 net. Then we get title. We get on the deed. Now, here's the key to this whole thing. You need private lender money. And if you need to be able to get private lender money, we teach how to do that. But here's the simple way to do it. First of all, ask everybody that you know, Hey, how would you like to get 10% on your money? And the second thing, go to REIA meetings and say, we will give 10% 10, uh, 10 on your money and we will pay you off, not in a year, but we'll pay you off within three or four months. So let's say we get on title, we give a note. So it's basically a no money down deal, but you're doing a joint venture with the seller. We borrow the 10,000 and we do the work. Then we hire a realtor or use the same realtor and we sell the property for 100000 Now I've allotted for $10,000 in uh, sales cost, which is like $6,000 in realtor fees plus another three grand or so in closing costs. And we pay the note off. This is the 69000 We pay that off. Then we pay the private lender, not 10000 but 11000 so add it up, 69 plus 11, and you're dealing with 80 there, okay? And then we pay another um, 10,000 in realtor plus closing costs, and we're left with about 10,000. And that's how you make $10,000 by doing a joint venture with the home seller. And you do need a vacant property, and you do need to put together a joint venture agreement that says, A, you're going to buy it, you're going to give them a note, and B, you're going to pay it off within four months with no payments. And you do need to be able to have access to $10,000 in private lending money. But I like this for minor rehabs because it's better than the 70% ARV minus costs. I hope you've enjoyed this com uh, conversation. This is not wholetailing. Uh, wholetailing is where you're doing a minor rehab and selling it, but it's not FHA mortgage ready somebody else is doing some sweat equity. So you might have uh, everything ready but paint and carpet and somebody moves in and does that on their own. Not wholetailing. This is a joint venture with the home seller. Thanks very much for listening.